Okay, okay. Does anybody have a real question? Yes, Hunter. It's a real question. So, how does giving a passenger a ride actually make a difference in how a car drives? Oh, well, this is because the guy can tell if the upholstery was ripped by the other passengers. So then the car can never get back that new car feeling again. Yeah. Well, we told you it was controversial. That sneak peek at the new Hulu original teen comedy, Plan B. And you might be surprised to find the creative force behind it because you know her best from appearing in hit series like, oh, Dead to Me, so good, and Parks and Recreation. But now she has added the title of feature film director to her credits. We're so happy to have her here with us. Natalie Morales, welcome to GMA3 and congratulations on your solo directorial debut. But tell us about Plan B. Hi, thank you so much for having me. <laughs> um, I, I wouldn't say it's controversial at all. It's, it's a teen, you know, R-rated comedy like we've <laughs> all grown up with. Um, it is R-rated, I will say that. But it's, it's about a movie uh, it's a movie about two girls uh, in America's heartland trying to get the Plan B pill. Yeah, there you go. Uh, and and I, 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 I know that you were so excited about getting this going. And then the pandemic hit. There was a big delay in shooting it. You didn't know if it was going to happen. Tell us how you made it all come together. Yeah, I mean, we were we were shooting this in um, we're s set to shoot this in March of 2020. And of course, like the entire world, we, we got shut down. We actually got shut down the day before we were supposed oh. to start filming. Um, so then we uh, we put a bunch of incredible uh, and very strict protocols in place uh, and, and picked up again in October of 2020. And um, and we were able to shoot it very safely. No one on our cast or crew even got a cold. <laughs> and um, and I'm very, very thankful for that. Oh, that's amazing. And I know you're really proud of this because another unique aspect of this film is we're seeing, you said, teen girls, right? Teen girls having fun. A lot of times we see some of these uh, dramatic comedies or especially things that are like maybe R-rated focused around boys or men. This is about girls. And tell us why that was an important part for you. Yeah, I mean, I, you know, I, I grew up with uh, with movies that that like were centered around around boys and, and especially only white boys, you know, like Superbad or uh, Ferris Bueller or Can't Hardly Wait or any of the American Pie, you yeah. know, all of these uh, teen coming of age comedies were always uh, were always centered around boys. And um, I think. Lately, there's been a, a resurgence of these with uh, with women at the at the lead, and um, we have those stories too. I mean, teen girls have have a lot of fun, so I think it's <laughs> it's worth telling from that perspective as well. It's interesting hearing you uh, rattle off. I, the only one I could think of was Sixteen Candles because you know you got the little Molly right. Ringwald in there, but I feel like you're bringing it back with a new twist in a, in a in a modern way. So this is so cool for so many people. We can't wait to watch. The film is called Plan B. You can check it out on Hulu beginning this Friday. Natalie Morales, congratulations again, and thanks so much for being with us today. Thank you so much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching. And we'll see you in the morning on GMA.